Lawsuits in Pennsylvania to stop and withdraw certification. And Ted Cruz is up for it, I think. And a little bit of an update in Georgia. The rhinos are in charge and they're going right along with the Democrats. But Sidney Powell is on the case. This is the end of hour one of the Jesse Lee Peterson Show, Tuesday, December 8th, 2020. I am James Hake. Stay tuned for hour two. Jesse Lee Peterson will be right back. But first, Hake news, not fake news. The PA lawsuit, Pennsylvania GOP state Senate, state lawmakers seek to withdraw certification of election results in a lawsuit, according to the Epoch Times, a group of 11 Pennsylvania voters, who are also state lawmakers, mostly, launched a lawsuit to asking the Pennsylvania Commonwealth Court to direct Governor Tom Wolf to withdraw certification of the 2020 general election results. The plaintiffs, among whom are nine Republican state lawmakers and one Republican state senator, led by State Representative Daryl Metcalf, M-E-T-K- M-E-T-C-A-L-F-E, also asked the court to issue an emergency order to temporarily block the state's 20 Democrat state uh, presidential electors listed on the lawsuit among, as among the defendants from casting votes for president, for, president, for uh, Joe Biden in the Electoral College based on the current election results. Other defendants in the suit are Tom Wolf and the Pennsylvania Secretary of State Kathy Buchvar, both Democrats. They cite violation of Pennsylvania's election code by Democrat county election officials primarily, problems with mail-in ballots, lack of oversight, transparency, or security. Lindsay Kensinger, a female spokesman for Tom Wolf, stated to the media, This is just another attempt by some Republicans to spread disinformation and ignore reality. Allegations of fraud are, and tired conspiracy theories have been repeatedly debunked and dismissed by the courts, she said. She also claimed, despite all evidence, that PA had a free and fair election and accused the Republican lawmakers of trying to steal the vote of Pennsylvanians. That's rich, right? Accusing them of doing what you did. And is Ted Cruz back on our side? Senator Cruz agrees to argue the Pennsylvania election case if it is taken up by the U.S. Supreme Court, according to the Epic Times. Pennsylvania Republicans filed a request to block finalizing of the certification, citing constitutional challenges. They also want the U.S. Supreme Court to review the PA Supreme Court's decision, Pennsylvania State Supreme Court. The former Texas Solicitor Solicitor General, Ted Cruz, said that he was asked and would stand ready to present oral arguments. We'll see. This, This is the case brought by Congressman Mike Kelly, congressional candidate Sean Parnell, and state representative Wanda Logan challenging the constitutionality of the presidential election results in PA. He also said that the bitter division and acrimony we see across the nation needs resolution. I believe SCOTUS, that's the Supreme Court of the United States, has a responsibility to the American people, Ted Cruz is saying, to ensure within its powers that we are following the law and following the Constitution. And in Georgia, Sidney Powell files a notice of appeal in the Georgia election lawsuit, according to the Epoch Times. She appealed to the U.S. Court of Appeals for the 11th Circuit late Monday, yesterday. Earlier yesterday, U.S. District Court Judge Timothy Batten, a George W. Bush rhino appointee age 60, dismissed Powell's lawsuit earlier Monday, opining that the plaintiffs had no standing to sue, that they should have brought the lawsuit to state court rather than federal, and that they filed the case too late. Powell filed the lawsuit November 25th, a couple of weeks ago, more like, on behalf of the presidential electors for President Donald Trump. One of the core allegations of the lawsuit concerns election machines and software by Dominion Voting Systems. The lawsuit cited several affiants, affiants who claimed that the Dominion machines were manipulated to illegally alter the outcome of the November 3rd election. But the Georgia Secretary of State affirmed the election results in favor of Biden. That's Rhino Brad Raffensperger. Trump called Kemp Biden and Kemp and Raffensperger rhinos. Nice. I'm James Hake.